Dash Clock Widget is one of the most popular Android widgets around, and it's all about the extensions. I'm Taylor Martin, this is Pocket Now, and these are the best extensions for your Dash Clock Widget. Widgets are undoubtedly one of the best parts of the Android experience. They offer at-a-glance information and turn what might otherwise be a boring home screen into something that looks great or is interactive, or even both. One of the most popular widgets available today was made by one of Google's own, Roman Nurek, and is called Dash Clock Widget. On the surface, it looks like nothing more than a standard clock widget that displays a few bits of information, but it doesn't take a lot of digging to realize there's a lot more to it than that. Within the settings, sure, you can tweak the appearance of the widget, change the clock and date style, the opacity of the background, and you can even change the color of the text in the daydream mode. But as soon as you enter Dash Clock settings, you're met with the defining feature of the widget, extensions. You can add and rearrange the order of the existing extensions, and if you hit Action Overflow, you will be given the option to get more extensions from Google Play. There are dozens and dozens, maybe even hundreds of Dash Clock extensions, and more are being added as standalone extensions or packaged within existing apps all the time. To save you the time and trouble of sifting through them all, we've composed a list of our favorite Dash Clock extensions. Most of these extensions don't do a whole lot. They aren't meant to. They're just there for shortcuts or to display some snippet of info. Google Voice for Dash Clock, for example, displays your unread count for Google Voice SMS. Dash Clock Hangouts extension does the same for the Hangouts app. And Plume extension for Dash Clock, the same for the Plume Twitter client. Press has a built-in extension for Dash Clock, which displays a number of unread articles. And my personal favorite, Clout Dash Clock extension, helps me keep tabs on my Clout score. There are also extensions for Dash Clock that allow you to monitor your phone status, such as Dash Clock Hardware Extension, which displays your current CPU usage as well as how much RAM is being used. Dash Clock Storage Extension helps monitor how much free storage your device has left. And Dash Clock Battery Extension, as the name alludes, displays your battery level percentage as well as other useful information about your battery usage, such as how long you've been on battery power, temperature, how long until fully depleted or charged, etc. We also like to keep up with the weather at a glance, and Eye in the Sky Weather has a nice extension for Dash Clock built into the existing app. And we like to keep track of the sunrise and sunset times with Dash Clock Sunrise extension. If you need to keep track of how far away a certain date or event is, Countdown Dash Clock extension is quite useful. Unlike most other extensions, it allows for up to three countdown timers that can be customized. It's 241 days, 8 hours, and 19 minutes until my next birthday and it's 93 days until Thanksgiving. Not every extension for Dash Clock, however, is simply for displaying information. PowerLock Dash Clock Plus widget is a settings toggle extension. Configure the extension to do what you need in the initial setup, and tap the extension in the widget view. It can toggle Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, GPS, and turn the display off or lock it if you have a password or pin set. A great use for daydream mode and from the lock screen. These are the Dash Clock widget extensions we regularly use, but there are many more we didn't cover, so be sure to tell us your favorite extensions in the comment section below and answer a question for us. Is Dash Clock Widget and its many extensions helpful to you, or is it something you can do without? Personally, I don't go a day without Dash Clock and at least a half dozen extensions. It's the epitome of what an Android widget should be. That's going to do it for this video. If you enjoyed it, let us know by clicking the thumbs up button below and subscribing. Find us on Twitter, Facebook, and Google Plus at Pocket Now. You can find me on Twitter at Casper Tech. I'm Taylor Martin, and I will see you next time.